Hello everyone, share technology and share life. In the previous video, I introduced you the that Huawei mobile phone install Google GMS by installing GSpace or Dual Space to use the Google App Store, install YouTube, Google Maps, and other Google applications. If you use everything normal after the installation, but after a few days of use, you may encounter some unstable situations such as a crash. Then you need to uninstall and reinstall the GSpace or Dual Space to solve the problem. And furthermore, some applications cannot be used in GSpace or Dual Space, such as Google Chrome. So today, I brought to you another solution to install the Google GMS and the Google App Store by installing a virtual machine on the phone. This method is a bit more stable than the above mentioned two methods, and you can use Chrome and synchronize your bookmarks to browse normally. The Google Maps can also be used normally, and it can also be used to play games. Okay, let me show you step by step on my phone. Let's go. Okay, now welcome to my phone. I will show you on my phone step by step uh, for you to how to install this uh, virtual machine to use Google Play Store and uh, to use the Google GMS. Okay, uh, now let's uh, move to the browser, the Huawei, the, I mean the stock browser down below. You click the browser to download this application to install the Google GMS. Now uh, I already opened the official website. I will provide the web link for you uh, down below this video for you. You just click that link and to download the uh, uh, APK file to install the Google for, uh, Google GMS and Google uh, App Store. Okay, the, this application name is V Phone Gaga. is a safe and free virtual phone to use this application to uh, use the uh, Google's App Store. Okay, uh, you can let have a look. So. Some uh, comes with Google Framework, solve problem with Huawei series phone. You can see the introduction, solve problem with Huawei series phone to use the uh, Google application, Google App Store. Okay, then go down, let's have a look. The app games are stable when multi-boxing, multi-Facebook chat. So some, some instruction, some uh, useful uh, focal point for you to have a look. So game, you can you, uh, play games on this uh, on this virtual machine so extremely performance so this virtual machine's performance is very very good i think this is a most uh, efficient uh, virtual machine to be used to compare with other kind of a virtual machine okay okay now let's go back uh, i just download this um, this application you needed to download the f uh, 64 64 bit D click download then uh, you can see this uh, down click uh, uh, pop up window then click download okay click download then uh, let's uh, let's click the three dot and uh, here at the downloads you can see I already downloaded this file see so I just uh, uh, cancel it so cancel um, because I already downloaded it here down below 1607 uh, this one so uh, I will not uh, uh, I will delete it because I already downloaded it. So this one already downloaded it. So I will, uh, to save some time, I just click, click install this application. Okay, so now you need to allow, allow this uh, authority, click allow. And uh, now it is checking, then click install this uh, virtual machine, install. Now uh, it's very fast. Um, so waiting to finish the installing. Okay, now uh, we finished the installing of this uh, virtual machine, Weifeng Gaga. Then click down, done. Then go back to your desk desktop. You can see this new uh, icon is here. This uh, is uh, Weifeng Gaga. Then let's uh, first round off this uh, virtual machine. Then click some agree, continue to use. Okay, some also some instruction. Weifeng Gaga is a safe and uh, uh, very very extreme performance comparable to real machine very fast so okay some in introduction right so it's a free version it's, it's free of use okay go back then click enter v from gaga click that and turn on the floating window function we need to turn on the floating window to give the uh the authority of floating window then go back okay so then uh, to authorize this uh, authority to authorize 
allow only when in use. Allow, allow, and allow. And okay, now the system is start. So first round a little bit slow, but the second round will be faster than uh, the current status bar. Okay, now we already logged in this uh, with this uh, virtual machine. Now next, click some, there's some instruction. We click next step, and uh, here I got it. Okay, now I will introduce the function of this virtual machine. You can have a look that uh, uh, the Play Store and uh, the YouTube already pre-installed in this uh, on this phone. So first we needed to have a look of the system setting here and uh, give you, I will give some you in some instruction of uh, how to uh, of the uh, instruction of the settings here the first one is display setting you can uh, uh, set the uh, resolution settings display FPS okay go back then GMS setting which already enabled the Google service framework so it is uh, easy for you because it is already uh, in storage for framework root you can see here the root is enabled but you can uh, disable this root like uh, uh, here if you don't want to dis uh, the root then restart now then the machine will be restarted okay then uh, the root is closed you can see it's very fast when you second around this uh, virtual machine when you second around the uh, it's very fast now okay then go back to the setting so navigation setting here you just floating just leave it and uh, the sensor sensors setting or by default you, you don't need to change it the phone model setting here so you can see this is a virtual machines uh, phone model is uh, manufactured Huawei WLZ AN00 so this is a virtual machines uh, phone model. So if you see some uh, like a security uh, warning said that there's a phone logged on to your uh, Google account uh, with this phone model. So because you know the virtual machine is using this phone model to log uh, to logging on to your uh, to your Google account. Okay, the camera setting here and uh, the clipboard setting enable clipboard sharing and the background process control. So we already uh, leave them by default now the language follow the system so you can change the language into chinese or english or follow the system so my system is in english so now this uh, i mean this uh, is in english okay so that's the setting of this uh, virtual machine it's very simple right and straightforward and uh, you can uh, i can show you here then this is a floating bar click here go to the real phone yeah you can see this is my real phone and uh, you can go back to uh, virtual machine here so the switch is very fast right you can uh, switch back the 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 real phone or here and or and switch back to real phone and the virtual machine so it's very easy right and uh, you can also using the floating bar you can see the virtual machine can be floating uh, above your real phone here okay then you can go to the virtual machine then let's uh, Another setting is you need to prevent the Huawei real real phone to, I mean, close your uh, close your uh, virtual machine. Then you need to uh, uh, setting the power usage. I mean, the power setting to prevent the real phone to kill this uh, virtual machine. Okay, uh, let's go to the settings to set the uh, power usage to prevent the uh, Huawei's uh, phone uh, system to kill this uh, Wii Phone Gaga. To kill these sessions, uh, which will, uh, if it, if this session is killed, then you cannot receive like a message, a messages from the Facebook message or WhatsApp message. So we need to prevent uh, the system kill this V phone Gaga sessions. We go to app, and go to app, and then we find this uh, V phone here, V phone Gaga here, and to uh, change the settings of the power usage details. Then we need to change the uh, app launch here. Click the app launch background background activity not restricted. Click here, and you need to click uh, close this manage automatically and auto launch uh, switch on. 
secondary launch switch on, run in the background switch on. So you need to click three of them switch on to prevent the uh, real phone to kill this uh, VPhone Gaga sessions to prevent to prevent uh, your uh, your your Facebook message or WhatsApp message. You can which will then we will cannot cannot receive this uh, kind of uh, messages. So now it's okay. We finished. Go back to the desktop. Now when we go back to the VPhone Gaga here, then we can uh, have a look of this uh, YouTube if it works or not. Let's click the YouTube. Then oh, you need to install this uh, YouTube. Yeah, you can. Uh, okay, so you need v Okay, you just uh, need to uh, go into the Google Play Store here. Yeah, Google Play Store to install the YouTube. Now you need to click sign in to sign in to your uh, Google account. Okay, uh, you key in your Google account, your good Gmail Gmail address. Okay, now the because the keyboard is in, in Chinese, then you need to change it to English here. English, yeah. Then you key in your English. Okay, then key in your uh, Gmail address and click next. Then key in your password, then click next. Okay, then click I agree. Okay, the backup to Google Drive will switch off. Accept, click accept. Okay, so we now logged into the uh, Google Google's App Store. Then you can install the application you want to use. Now we uh, install, search the uh, Google map to install the map. Okay, Google map, click install. Okay, so we uh, nearly finished installing this uh, Google map. Okay, Google map was uh, finished installation, finished uh, install. Then we search the YouTube to install the YouTube. Okay, so install this YouTube, click install. Okay, so the YouTube is installing, it's very fast. So we already finished the YouTube installing and the Google map installing. Then we go back to the desktop. Then we have a run of this uh, Google map. Let's have a look. The Google map, let's have a run. The first round of the Google map. Uh, the first round you will find the, uh, the uh, position spot is in gray. So we need to click the position and allow the access of the location, allow. And uh, Okay, the first round you will find that uh, this uh, your location, location spot is in gray color, in gray color. Then you need to uh, restart the virtual machine, to restart the virtual machine. Okay, let's go back to your real phone and uh, power off. Click power off, confirm. Okay, so now it's uh, closed. Then we second round the VPhone Gaga. So, so this round, and you can after that, then you can use the uh, uh, Google Map normally. Okay, let's go to the Google Map. Click here. Then you will find that uh, your location spot will be in the blue color. So now you can use the uh, uh, Google Map to navigate normally as you normal use. So it's very easy, right? Okay, so now let's go back to the desktop. Then we let's have a look, use this uh, YouTube. Let's have a look this uh, YouTube. Click the YouTube to have a look if it uh, can uh, uh, run or not. Yes, so yeah, now you can see we can run the YouTube easily and you can play the video. And there's another thing you need to pay attention is this is very useful function is you can uh, switch off your screen. You can turn off your screen and listen to the background uh, voice, background sound of your video. So it's very easy and friendly for you to use because you can uh, turn off your screen and uh, you can still can play YouTube uh, just the background. This function is very very useful if you want to if you don't want to watch the video just just only to listen to the sound. So it is a very useful function, right?
Okay, okay, I hope this video is helpful for you. And if you feel this video is interesting, just sum up and subscribe this channel to avoid missing future updates. See you next time. Bye bye.